Hello everybody, this is Sapler Creations and I'm Sapler and today I'm going to show you three simple ways that I use to cut images. Okay, so the reason I am making this tutorial is to show some people that might want to make their own design how to cut out their own character because I know most of you guys are on my channel because I made some channel designs for uh, World of Warcraft people and some, wa some people want their own so I'm just gonna make this because this is the hardest part of making a channel design so let's get to it shall we first I'm gonna tell you about the thing some people use to cut images with and that's the lasso tool the thing about the lasso tool is that you have to be very how can I say balanced and you almost need a tablet to use it by going through here like you can't see me doing it because I suck uh, using the normal lasso tool but they go around and cut it like that the thing I use which is much more friendly is the polygonal lasso tool the thing this one does is that you can zoom in and click and then you can get the wide a totally perfect straight line down this is what I use the most the thing about using this one is that you should go across the outer edge of the pixels like this and just follow it down all the way the thing about uh, Will of Warcraft characters is that they're not perfectly round all the time so it's quite easy to use this tool you can use this tool also around very round edges by going step for step this is also taking a lot of time but I think the outcome is worth it so the thing you do is just you cut your way with this tool as you can see I'm going a little bit inside of the character like on the sword the reason why I'm doing this is so it doesn't get any orange on the outside so you don't get an orange line around the character if I begin to went exactly over the thing you will soon see that it will end up with an orange line about the whole thing so try to get across the, pic the the first line of pixels over the whole thing so now let's take a look this is also where you can do it if you don't want to cut the whole thing in one whole session you can take part from part by just going up instead of going further you can just go straight up click somewhere hold down CTRL control and click now you got one part ready right now you can just press delete and you can see that it's cut now we're gonna take some black make a new layer let's see you see how when I cut across the pixels it got pretty good but I got some orange right there but this is just uh, doing some on the run and here you see when I cut right above the pixel right next to the pixels it's still got a tiny orange line which is nothing you want if you're going to paste it on the background or something because it will get visible now I'm going to take that back because I want to keep that yes this is my death knight He's awesome. Okay, back to the subject. Another way to cut is the pen tool. I haven't used this much, but some people I know uses it. The way about you can use this pen tool is that it's easier to get more round edges. by stretching it 
you can get more clean and smooth edges than just going step for step. Of course, I, I, as I said, I'm not a fan of this tool. I just know that many people think it's much easier to use. And then after you have connected them, after taking a part you wanted to cut out, you can just press in the middle and click make selection. You don't have to edit anything right here unless you want a feather or anything like that and press OK. Then you will get this selection area again and you can press delete just like the lasso tool. So yeah, there is one more tool, which is not always good to use. The reason is, it requires a pretty solid background. It's the magical wand tool. The thing about this thing is that it targets one specific color. I don't know how good it will work on this one, but it was the solid, most solid color I could find on the World of Warcraft armory. If you use something like World of Warcraft Model Viewer or anything like that, you can choose a solid negative color and easily get a clean cut without any work at all. Here's an example. I click here where you see plenty of red while the skull helm and everything is white and blue and darkish. You click and you get a selected area around which is shows where it's trying to get as close and nice cut as possible. If I now press delete, you can see how it got cut. You can see all these marks is because the darker orange is going over to the lighter orange, which makes so it doesn't go farther down. That's why it's so dangerous to use. If you have a slight bit of orange on your gear, like the Wrathful to Warrior or something, with this background, it might sm uh, smudge over to the Wrathful gear, which is nothing you want. So to be on the safe side, I would either use the Pen tool or the Polygonal Lasso tool. So yeah, this is pretty much a very easy tutorial made by me, Sapler. I hope you liked it, I hope you learned from it. Please comment down below if it, there's something you're wondering. Please subscribe. Sapler out. Sapler Creations. Dot net.